Hi guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome, and if you're not, welcome back. Today we have another highly requested video, okay? And when I say highly, I mean highly. It has been requested since my channel blew up in like March of this year, so I'm getting around to it because I know you guys need some more gift ideas, so I figured let me just, let's get this one out, okay? So, this one is 50 cute Amigurumi crochet ideas. Now, this one we've got beginner to, to intermediate to advanced, mostly beginner um, within this entire video. There's only one category and that is Amigurumi. I tried to pick all of like the cutest ones I could find. So hopefully I was able to find you something that you can make. But before we get into it, everything I say obviously and always is linked down below in the description box in the order that I said it, linked to a paid or free written or video tutorial so that you can make whatever I'm showing you. So let's jump right in, shall we? So, for the first one we have is this really cute sea turtle, okay? Sea turtle, adorable. You can also make a really cute duck, okay? I, I'm gonna try to not say cute over and over and over again. Um, you can make a spring dragon or, oh my gosh, there's a hole. There's a hole in my long sleeve. <laughs> you can make a spring dragon or a little tea bag, super cute. You can make an Among Us plushie or this little Pete the Potato. You can make an alien, which I've actually added the alien onto my list after I saw it because I was like, this is so cute. You can make a red panda, a little pig, pig or piglet. It's really small, so I would say piglet. A uh, cherry, little cherries with some eyeballs. Um, you can make a bat that has wings that open and close. Super cute. Kind of looks like it's hugging itself. Adorable. You can make a toast, toast, toast or pastry or like a pop tart. Okay. Super cute. Or this little Bruno the polar bear. He likes to fish. He has a little satchel. Super cute. Uh, reminds me kind of of the mouse in a suitcase I did not that long ago. That one's super cute. You can make a butterfly or even this little baby mouse in a in Moses basket. Okay. Baby mouse in a basket. Super cute. You can make a banana split, ice cream, and like for this one, you can even not attach the scoops and make it kind of like a playset for a kid or something like that. That one's adorable. You can even make an alligator or a crocodile. I don't know the difference. It's either an alligator or a crocodile. You can make that. You can make these ones is like an avocado, a sun, a chick, boba, like super good, super fun, super cute. Now, these ones I found adorable. They're called curlies. They're like little people who like hug their knees to their chest. Adorable. I love it. I kind of want to make one now that I'm looking at it again. You can make a frog blob, which basically just looks like a frog with no legs or arms, um, but that one's cute. You can make an avocado or a cat donut or this no sew donut pattern for those of you who don't like attaching different parts like me and you just need a no sew pattern um you can make peas in a pod or this cheeky egg or a no sew cupcake or this cute little pastel plushy cat or gay pride frog hand rat a fluffy chicken. The possibilities are endless when it comes to Amigurumi, okay? Possibilities are endless. There's even octopus, and there are so many octopus patterns, but this is the one I'm going to recommend, but there are so many. I have done multiple, and they're all different, and they all look different, but this one's cute. You can make ice creams, turn them into keychains, or not, up to you. You can make stars, turn it into keychains, or not, again completely up to you. You can make this cute little cutie penguin with a Santa hat. I'm pretty sure this video comes out before Christmas, so if you want to make this one as an ornament, that would be really cute. You can make Care Bear dupes or even this pocket otter. Adorable! Okay, we already know otters are just like adorable in general, but imagine an otter tiny crocheted and with like some blanket or velvet yarn, okay? 
love it. You can even make these mini earths. I love that there's like a theme here. There's like a little plant one. There's a mother nature one and a little earth giving you a heart. Adorable. I love it. You can make some gingerbread. This one is like specifically the gingerbread from Shrek, it looks like. But yeah, you can make a gingerbread with or without the missing leg. Um, you can make some little mini dinos, which are always cute. This one's an axolotl. Now, I have a couple of these have like the pattern just like written on the Pinterest thing. So there's a little axolotl like this one. And then a similar style is this little bee, which I know the bees are super popular at markets. So if you're planning on doing a market anytime soon, definitely crochet bees. I don't know what it is, but people go feral for crocheted bees. No matter what color you do, you can make Minecraft zombie bees, you can make pride bees, you can make like Valentine's bees. For some reason, people lose their mind when they see a crocheted bee and they buy it immediately. So that's always a good market one for all of you who are asking me for market ideas. Um, a full video for that is coming soon, but that's what I got for you now. You can also make this cloud, sleepy little cloud. I love it, super cute. You can make this Norwal. Norwal? Narwhal? Narwhal. Why do I feel like that's wrong? Okay, well, Narwhal plushie. You can also make a bigger little axolotl than the one I showed you earlier. This one's longer. It's more like adulty. It's not like a keychain size. That one's cute. And then here's a bigger bumblebee than the one I showed you earlier. The one I showed you earlier was littler. So this one's bigger. You can even make a um, bird keychain. I've made this bird pattern before. Super cute. I personally cannot stand working with tiny yarn and tiny hooks. So keychains and like small things are just not for me. They're not in the cards for me, but that is okay. Not everything has to be in the cards for you. Um, you can also make this cute snake plant. I love a crocheted plant, especially one with eyes and a mouth. You can make this octopus, which I love it because it's like little flat on your palm. Imagine this like sitting on a desk. Wouldn't that be so cute? I love that. You can even make this shark plushie, which is perfect for our shark fans. I know Dylan loves sharks and has requested me to make a shark plushie for Christmas, and I have yet to do that, but I will. Um, but those are super cute. And then this one has a bunch of different kinds. Now, this creator specifically... Uh, little bear crochets, I'm pretty sure. All of their crochet, like, bears and stuff have this same, like, tall, long torso, long arm kind of, like, crochet style. And I have you, I have bought several of their patterns before, and I love it. I love it so much. I've made the bigger one. I think I even made, like, they have a polar bear. I'm pretty sure they have a polar bear that I've made. I downloaded, like, the bear one specific oh yeah the bear one I did the bear one and I just changed the colors to make it a polar bear that one's really cute um I have like the cow one not sponsored I just wanted to shout that out because I have used their patterns before and they are good so definitely recommend that so that is all of the 50 amigurumi crochet ideas that I have for you. Hopefully you we're able to find one, hopefully. Um, if not, and you need some more ideas, just comment down below and I can make another one. And if you have like specifics you're wanting, just let me know and I can make another one. Um, but as always, everything I said is listed in the description box below, linked to a paid or free written or video tutorial so that you can make whatever I'm showing you. If you're looking for the picture I used, it's all on a cohesive Pinterest board, which is also linked down below along with my tiktok and my instagram if you want to check me out over there i'm trying to grow those so go follow me over there and check out mine and dylan's podcast we have a video podcast if you need something to watch while you're crocheting go sub over there we're trying to hit a thousand subscribers by the end of the year hopefully that's our goal um but yeah and go comment and let us know what we can do differently and you know what we can do to kind of make our channel better we're always open to feedback and we're trying to grow the channel over there so let us know if there's anything we can do and other than that i will see you guys in the next video i love you bye